Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode. My name is Boss. In this episode, I'm going to be showing you how to use the Rotator Gizmo to make really cool stuff like... This. So as you can see, I have these three planes. Yes, I know they look like potatoes, but I'm really bad at making stuff in this game. These three planes, and they're just flying around near the roof of my dorm room. So today I'm going to be showing you how to do that. So, the first thing you want to do is open up your watch. You can do that by looking at your hand. And you want to go to Backpack. And make sure you're in the Tools. And you'll see Maker Pen. And you want to hit Use. That should summon your Maker Pen. Now you want to grab that. And look at this little screen here. It's going to open up your Maker Pen menu. You want to hit Open Padlet. And then you want to go to Gadgets. And then Gizmos. So when you're here, you want to click on Rotator. And then you can summon a rotator. So I'm just going to put that right there. Um, yeah, that's good. And then you also now want to go to math chips and summon a variable chip. This variable chip is important for a lot of stuff, so it's good to know how to use this. So uh, you want to go to configure. And you want to go to, you want to click on the, the variable chip when you have selected configure in the maker pen menu and so you have these signals R signal, G signal, and B signal. It actually took me a lot of uh, time to figure out what the signals mean. That just uh, corresponds to these colors. So red, R signal, green, green signal, and then blue, B signal. So we're just going to set R signal to 1. Actually no, we're going to set it to 20. So we're going to set it to 2... 2... The watch is getting in my way. Zero. So this is going to determine how fast the rotator is going to go. So, so now the red one has a signal of 20. And if I put that over here, I can hover it over the green one. It says rotation speed. So it means the value of the rotation speed for the rotator gizmo is going to be to uh, is going to be 20. So if we wire that, now it has a, this has the rotation speed of 20 but it's not activated yet it's not hooked up anything hooked up to anything yet so i'm gonna show you how to do that so right here in inventions i have a lot of stuff i can use but i'm gonna go shapes and colors i'm just gonna use a uh let's just use a cube for this instance i'm just gonna place a cube right there that's good and then i'm gonna um hold down uh go to the maker pen menu hit wire and this little tip sticking out of the uh, rotator gizmo. You want to connect that to whatever you've made. And then you want to go back to configure. Go to this. Set any signal to 1. And you're going to wire that signal to this. To the on and off. So basically this is just saying uh, basically what this means on slash off. It's saying if there's a signal turn it on. That's basically what it is. So we have a signal one, doesn't matter how high it's gonna be, it's always just gonna be a loop. And so we're sending that signal of one to the on and off, which is gonna turn it on, and then this is gonna spin in a circle. So, and then you can do this as many objects as you want. So if you go to open Padlet settings, you can hit, um, you can stop all the gizmos. And if I actually turn behind me, you can see that you can attach multiple um, objects to it. So I can do, I can like clone this here. I can put it up there, and then I can wire you to go up there. And I can uh, here wait. I can go to shapes and colors. I can make a uh, blackish grayish pyramid. I could also attach that like that. And if I go back, open Padlet, Settings, and play Gizmos, they're all going to spin around a circle. So yeah, that's how you use the Rotator Gizmo in Rec Room. Well, if you did enjoy the video, make sure to give it a big fat thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace!